Hello everybody, here's my mama and she's gonna be making her, it says it right there, super moist strawberry cake mix. But we're gonna call it a strawberry delight cake. Yep, cause it's got all kinds of strawberries in it. <laughs> yeah, it's got every type of strawberry that you could put into something. Yeah. But she's gonna show you all the ingredients and she's gonna walk you through it step by step on how she makes it. And I'll let her take it from here. Okay, we gotta get her pan out. And we gotta spray it. You can use whatever type of oil that you like, but this yeah. is uh, olive oil. Yeah. And then we're gonna start mixing. We take our super moist, delightful strawberry cake mix. It's delightful because it's got a lot of strawberries in it. And I like strawberries. Y'all know that, don't you? I told you about my snake and strawberries, didn't I? Snake was about to get me. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what video it was on or I would tell y'all, but she said it in maybe two separate videos of her strawberry story. Here's the box. And uh, since we might have some new ones, I'll tell you about it. When I was a little girl, and I know a lot of you done heard it, um, our back of our house was uh, had strawberries, wild strawberries. And every morning, mom would give us a bowl to go pick strawberries, and because uh, it's right there in the backyard up on the hill there, and uh, we'd go up there and uh, look for strawberries and come back and we put canned milk in it and sugar, and that's what we would eat for breakfast, and. Uh, I went up there and dad told us before we went out, I said, now don't get around no rocks or nothing. I said, uh, because, um, give me these eggs. Because uh, snakes lay around rocks. I said, uh, we said, okay. So we went up there and my brothers, my two brothers went on up above me and he's this big rock with big juicy strawberries. And I'm like, oh, I'm gonna get those. And uh, I went over and kneeled down, and there was a copperhead right in my face. I couldn't do that. I was froze. And uh, I guess my brothers seen me up there and knew what it was. So they come running off the hill and hit me, and we just rolled on down the hill. And Dad went up there and killed a great old big copperhead. And... Uh, he said, I told y'all to stay away from them rocks. You know how girls are. Sometimes they're hard-headed. <laughs> Sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes. <laughs> okay, we use one-third cup of oil in this. Uh, and that was uh, three eggs that she put in there. Yeah, three eggs. So it's got the cake mix in there, out of the box. And three. it's three eggs. And then... One-third of oil. Uh, third cup of oil. You can use whatever kind. But this is a uh, vegetable oil. Yeah, and then a uh, cup of water. And you mix it all up real good. See the strawberry flavor there coming out? And we're gonna do something a little bit extra. We're gonna put strawberries in it. I've got a few extra ingredients for this one that's gonna make it a special, <laughs> really special cake. And when it gets uh, uh, done, oh, let me see, it goes on, um, I think it was 350. Uh, it's supposed to be for 26 to 31 uh, minutes, and it's supposed to be 325. So we stir this real good. And I sliced up some strawberries. So this is probably a half a box of strawberries diced up into small pieces. And I didn't go on the mountains and get them. I went to the store. <laughs> uh, you know, you can't find wild strawberries no more. Uh, you they can still grow them, big. but... Yeah, you can grow them, but years ago, we didn't grow them. They just automatically was on the hillsides. And, uh, but the, don't, I have never seen none since. And here's our strawberries. It's probably and a half of a small pack of yeah. uh, strawberries. We're going to put all these in here. And we're going to stir them up in there. 
Now this is gonna be a strawberry, strawberry cake. We have strawberry, whipped strawberry, uh, cream cheese. That's gonna be the icing. And then strawberries. We're gonna have a little bit of that on top of it. Uh, this will be the topping. This is be the frosting. Yeah. So we're gonna put this down and then this on top of it. Yeah, maybe put it just in a round circle around the cake or a square. Yeah. Yeah. And just further yeah. like the. So it's a strawberry what it... delight. That's what it's gonna be. It's gonna be a delight. So we stir this up real good. And uh, Richard and Sandy's supposed to come up today, so, so we'll have some strawberry cake. And I fixed some potato salad a while ago. And uh, that's about done. And so we'll pour this in here. Mm, it looks yummy and smells yummy. See the strawberries in that? Don't that look yummy? If you like strawberries, <laughs> some people might not like them. Okay. Now this goes in the oven on uh, 325. Oh no, 350. Glass pan 325 for uh, 21 to 30 or 26 to 31 minutes. And mom always done this three times, she says. <laughs> That's what we done. So we'll have to come back for this. Now let me see, I don't have it on there, do I? 350, then you press yeah. start. It's already on 350, uh -huh. so. You're supposed to preheat it, but I'm gonna go ahead and put it in here. I do that a lot. And I forget to turn it on. But we're going to do that. And when it gets done, we're going to put our uh, frosting and our other strawberries on it. Right, so we're going to cut the video whenever this is done. And it should be 21 to 30 minutes, I guess it said. Yeah, 31 minutes. Yeah, yeah. and then we'll be right back with y'all whenever it's done. And she's going to put the frosting and topping on it. And she's going to pray for y'all. And she's not going to be reading at the end of this video because they got... God's true word is going to be a live stream on this channel and that'll be they're going to be doing that in probably two hours from now yeah. so y'all uh, tune in for that later on if y'all want to see some reading of the word and I uh, ask y'all to forgive us we didn't uh, put none on yesterday we supposed to done the Sunday message but we didn't get to do it uh, Papa was uh, I tell you what he done he took about four sleeping pills because he couldn't go to sleep and he don't like to go to a Sunday school and sleep. <laughs> but, and uh, so he, he couldn't sleep. So he said he took, what, Corey, one or two? I think he and, said four melatonins. Yeah, and he, but he said he took one or two and he couldn't sleep, so he took some more so he wouldn't sleep in Sunday school. And guess what, y'all? He slept all day yesterday. <laughs> I told him, I said, you don't do that. You take two and you wait for it to kick in. <laughs> yeah, I was always told that uh, melatonin, you're only supposed to take one no matter what. And if you take two, it can potentially be dangerous. And if you take any more than that, it's definitely, that gets dangerous. We and it's very bad for you to take melatonin. Yeah, we had to watch him. <laughs> yeah, well, we're going to have to throw the Don't melatonin away. <laughs> He's going to shake these hand at us. Yeah. <laughs> we're telling on him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to have to throw them uh, melatonin away. And uh, I got some other <laughs> sleeping medicine. It's called Sleep Aid. And I already talked to my doctor about it. And he said that they was fine to take. So yeah. I'm going to have to put them Sleep Aid in there and uh, throw the melatonin away. <laughs> oh, Lord. But he hates going to church and falling asleep. And he can't sleep at nighttime. You know, he, he says he tries to sleep and he just can't sleep. Yeah, I have the same problem, too. I can lay in there with my eyes closed all night long and not sleep. Yeah, that's what he said, too. So... But we'll be back in a little bit and we'll put the frosting on our uh, cake and then we'll uh, see you at six o'clock uh, for God's true word. Yeah, we love y'all. God bless y'all. Make sure to like and subscribe if y'all are still watching this. But we'll be right back with y'all here in just a second. Love y'all. Yeah. Bye-bye.
All right, we're back, y'all, and uh, this is what the cake will look like after it's fully done, after she took it out of the oven, and then she put it into this plate. But she's gonna show y'all the the last steps. Yep. So we got this uh, whipped strawberry cheese cake, Ada. Cheese. Yep. It's cream cheese, cream strawberry cheese. cream cheese, I think. So we're gonna try to put it on here, I think, and it smells delicious. The cake's cold now, so it should go on pretty good. Yeah, we let the we let it cool down too after we got it out. Yeah. Normally we get it out on the video, but we didn't think I forgot about it for this one. Yeah. So we just uh, went ahead and took it out and put it in the freezer to let it cool off real quick, so we can go ahead and finish this part of the video for y'all. You always. Done the eclipse, and we so uh, all excited about that and everything. So, but maybe this cheesecake, strawberry cheesecake stuff smells good. This is better than the icing. Okay, and we're gonna try to put some more strawberries on it. This is a strawberry delight. That's what this is. It is really gonna be good. Yeah, that was exciting about the eclipse. I hadn't seen one since I was a little girl. But uh, what we done when we was little, uh, Dad uh, had cardboard, and he would just put it, uh, he put it up to our face, and he marked where our eyes was, and then he took a pen and put pinholes in it, and we looked through that that way. That's the way we done it then. We didn't have glasses and stuff. So now, we're going to try, I wonder, um, <laughs> that's going to be like a kid. That's what I used to do, Mom. <laughs> yeah, the kids always love uh, mm -hmm. yeah. eating off the utensils. These is the strawberry pie filling. Let me hold a cover in it. And I just thought that would be good around it. So, I didn't know where to put it around it like this. Or put it on top of it. What do you think, Corey? Uh, it's up to you. Maybe outline it would look nice. Outline the cake? If you can. Yeah, I think we can. And we get some strawberries. At first I thought to make a little heart out of it, but that would be really hard. Plus, it looks nice like this, too, running down the sides. Yeah. Let's put a little strawberry here. If y'all haven't seen the Eclipse video that uh, Mama was talking about, it's uploaded now. And y'all, by the time this video is out, the Eclipse video will already be up, too. So y'all go check that out. Let us know if y'all like it or not. Let us know what y'all think about the Eclipse video. Yeah, I thought it was exciting myself. Yeah, I held up the glasses to the camera so that way y'all could see what it looks like when you look through the glasses. Yeah, I love these uh, pie filling uh, cans that you get. Make pies and stuff with cheesecake, stuff like that. Strawberry is about one of my favorite fruits. But I love just about all berries. I like blackberry cobblers and apple cobblers, apple pies. I like all fruit. Trying to get to run down the sides a little bit. I'm gonna put this big strawberry weed there. And yeah, sure enough, it's running off the sides now. <laughs> All this whole piece just fell right off. Did it? Oh, it did, didn't it? 
me up. Little dab here, the little dab there. There's some in the middle. Just slid right off there, didn't it? We've been baking and cooking today. It's kind of hot in here too. I'm trying to get some more to put up there. There's our strawberry delight cake. It slid off on this side too. <laughs> it's just sliding off all over the place. Yeah, it's it'll be good though. Yeah. It's our strawberry delight. This is what it'll look like after it's fully done. This is the finished product. Here, let me hold it up. Looks no. delicious to me. Right, I'm almost going to pray for y'all now. Mm. If y'all are still watching, make sure to like and subscribe and leave a comment. Share us to Facebook if you have Facebook. Uh, Mama's going to pray for y'all now. Yeah, we're going to have a live stream here at 6 o'clock. So, uh, uh, God's true word. Sandy and Richard, 6. So they won't be with us today. It'll just be me and Milton today. So, uh, we're just going to pray together right now. Dear Lord Jesus, we just come to you, Lord, loving you and praising you, Lord. Thanking you for all your goodness and your mercy, Lord. Lord, for always walking with us and taking care of us, Lord. We thank you for that, Lord. Lord, ask you to touch our YouTube family out there, Lord. You see their needs, Lord. Lord, we just ask you to reach down and meet each need, Lord. Lord, you know their hearts desire about things, Lord. Their children, Lord Jesus. Lord, anyone that's got children out there, Lord Jesus, and they're not in the safety of you, Lord. We just ask you to take care of them, Lord Jesus. Take care of our children, Lord Jesus, that don't know you, Lord. Lord, and ask you to move upon them, Lord, that they'll open their eyes up to see that they need you, Lord. Lord, we just love you and praise you, Lord. Thank you for always being with us, Lord. Thank you for answering our prayers, Lord. I ask you to have your way in all things, Lord Jesus, in your mighty name, Lord. We love you and we honor you, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. God is good all the time. Man, we had a real good service uh, last night. Well, Sunday night. We had a real good service. Uh, it was about uh, this eclipse and the signs and the times in the skies. You know, y'all need to go back in Revelation uh, I think it's in Luke, Acts. I'll have to look it up and see where all it's at. But it's in different places. Uh, it talks about the signs of the times and talked about the signs in the skies and things that's coming up on the earth. You know, we need to be ready and prepared so when Jesus does come back, we'll be ready for him, you know. Because he loves us and he don't want to see us to go to hell, you know. But it's not him that sends us to hell. It's ourselves. If we don't know the Lord and we don't accept him, it's our choice whether to accept him or to accept the devil, you know. Some people say, but well, I'm a good person. I'm a good person. I don't do nothing bad. Yeah, but you have to accept the Lord Jesus Christ, you know. Read his word, talk to him, be true and faithful to him, you know. And he'll be true and faithful to you, and you'll get to be with him one day in paradise. So, and that's what we're, our main goal is, is to go to heaven with Jesus. So, we'll see y'all at 6 o'clock. Y'all take care. Love y'all. Thank y'all for all your uh, support for our YouTube uh, uh, channel, for uh, everything that you do for us. We thank you for it. So you have a good day today. Well, and, uh, that's all for this one. I hope y'all enjoyed the video. We love y'all, and God bless y'all, and we'll see y'all in the next one. That's right.